Hey, this is the one of my weightlet training as I'm actually trying to warm up and try to give you every single advice so why I actually do almost every single thing. So first of all, before I even start my training, I usually start with the warm up. So most of the time people ask me, why you start with warm up? But you already know warm up is one of the things that's also going to help you get your blood flow and also keep your bloody like your body temperature wise up a little bit. So with that, the injury part you are already skipping so this is a one of the good way i would come at everyone before any type of workout so it's really necessary to take that opportunity like to get yourself warm up and then to get things done and also when i while i'm trying to charge stretch it was like pretty cold at the time i was a little bit exhausted but it was pretty fine and cool like try just to do like 10 of 15 reps of more of the time so i usually do like four or three set or two set one set is still fine so you just need to find something to do before you start your workout so as the same thing i was gonna try to do with 45 so the first thing i did was just warm up with the bar only so i try to get it as much as i can i usually do like 10 or 15 so even though you see the gym was empty it was about like in the morning so there wasn't that much people around so i was trying to enjoy that time because around that time there are not like a lot of people in your circle so it's gonna be free for you like to just working out really simple now i say okay let me just add some weight and i'd go and just grab like 245 so i start if like right now the reason i start with 45 it was because I feel like I already warm up enough, but if I didn't like do any warm up at the beginning, I would start with 45. So I would start with 25. So as I start with 45, I was try try to go for like 10. So the first thing I did, I just count my reps. I say one and two, three, four, five six seven eight nine so the reason like i would comment everyone before you do any type of workout i would recommend try to always go a little bit deeper or try to do every single push high as you can you know and then you need to focus on your chest so you don't need like to go that much fast i've seen people just pump it so it's not a good thing i will never recommend that try to just go light as you can you know you just need like to move your weight you know don't go too fast because injury shoulders or in chest injuries you're gonna feel so bad that you're not gonna even like be aware they like to enjoy your workout you know so i really want you guys to be careful because gym is necessary at the same time but when you start getting injured and stuff you're out i really want to tell you all of those things because those things happen to me so when they happen like you feel sorry for yourself now i need guy to go to 225 i think i just had like my second 45 so on two side like 225 it was not that light but i was just trying to do like 15 or five i think i think it was five something like that i was just trying to do five but the thing about any type of way when trying to do this type of amount of pound always remember so you need to take break on your set so i skip the break part for you like not actually wasting a bunch of time watching me lifting weight so the first thing you need to focus on when trying to lift a big hammer of weight so make sure like you focus on contraction is one of the most important thing so make sure you contract your muscle and then try to go all the way up and then also focus on the amount of weight you lift you don't need to waste it that much you know i think i found the third part because i'm not gonna lie to you my chest is not that strong as like my deadlift for squat is you know i can squat like four or five but i would just say okay let me try again so i will try for my second time i think i did two or three something 
yeah he was a little bit like feel dying but he was actually worth it the trial was worth it because i was trying to get five of it and i did it you know i did three in the first one and also i did two in the second second reps again so now the only thing i got to focus on i just need like to add five for plus the reason i add like those five it was because for my trying something like a pr or something like that so what i did i'll just like check it one more time and then to see if it's actually gonna work and then i try it so 245 right now to see how that goes so now i just got like to see if i got like the energy and like to put it up so this is was like a little bit i said damn it looked like i do it i was just like push it that hard you know just to make it feel like comfortable so now i got also to move uh, another five pound i got to 10 and so let's see if i can do at least like one or two and climb bench press you know so it was uh, because you see i got my warps and everything so once you are wearing this it is because now time to go to work you know and then i just we worked we worked it and then i said okay let's go 255 so i tried 255 i just go a little bit pull it up it was a little struggle but i think i did it yeah it was my first time doing it it was pretty good and then now we go to the bench press climb so now when i started like the first thing i did with the first time as you can see i started my workout i usually try to do warm up it doesn't matter if i already did like the flat bench press so i did warm up but it was still fine so i got to redo it every single thing again the true reason about warm up as i say guys it's not like oh i'm ready let me just do it you just i have to do it for different reason it is because your muscle sometimes you think it's ready to work and then like you're gonna force it when that's happened and like you get an injury it's because that's happened to me recently i was just working out so i didn't warm up that much and then there was like something that's happened to my shoulders now i can't even leave that much pound you know it still hurt even though i took like two months not even work out that much as i used to and then it still hurt a little bit like the same thing as i was saying so don't give up to your workout you just got like to push most of the time but don't push that much if you see you can't actually go to where you want to you just need to be patient because weightlifting is all about like training process and just wait to go to the next move because most of the time we're just trying to see we see like someone doing something on social media then we say okay let me just try to do it but it doesn't work that way sometimes it took us those people like years to do them and i was trying to do like 135 i felt i almost like break my leg that shit was crazy so i got like to break it down and sit things out i was able like to manage that because there was nobody here to spot me and i saved myself up so you all the steps you need to know those technique when you feel like you want to do those things always try to get those technique up because they're gonna help you build your physique and everything you know so escape those injuries and then you're gonna be ready to go to everything now i'm still tracking my progress as to see i was just watching something on the tv this time sometimes it's happened like you working out and then like you see something then like you're just trying to enjoy the moment you know because fitness it's all about like enjoy the time when you're around you don't like to oh girl i can't work out i feel tired but it's okay if you feel like you're tired you don't feel like lifting a bunch of weight it's fine you don't need to go and try to force yourself you just got like to okay i'm gonna try to fake him that you just try to grab like a couple of pounds and stuff to get it things done so that was it that was everything for my bench car i didn't stick that long on that because my shoulder was a little bit hurting and then okay let me just move to my next exercises i need to 
working on my lower chest because it's one of the part that it's not that easy to fix it took me years i'm still working on that but i'm getting strong with legs and everything my arms getting stronger my physique also getting stronger a little bit but my chest is still not getting get it. now i got to move to my next exercises so i go deep with 225 because i skipped the warm up part but i did warm up because all i did was just like okay it's 225 i'm gonna try to do at least five as i usually do like when i'm trying to improve my weight i don't actually go like lower higher than five reps or sets i usually like do one set or two or three set of 25 so when you do like two sets it's also deep now i was just trying to do my body weight so my body weight chest chin up so i did at least five of this or seven i think but it was really good i was just holding the pressure so just working out really slowly as i could and then just enjoy the moment as i just say guys when you're working out you don't need like to force yourself just you feel your body working out you feel you take your break and you see you can do like the reps that you want to because my chest was on fire i was so really crazy with that workout and also i do some cable to help me get my chest on the on my size the way i really wanted you know it was pretty good and i feel i feel the vibe and i feel all those weight and it was great it was pretty good chest workout and those cable fly i do like four sets of 15 you know it was good and i go light i didn't go that heavier and also i do and also i did one the same also simple process like just holding the cable is like you're doing a arnold chest press and then you just try to stretch it out all the way up you know don't do half of it some people they just do like half of it and then like they bring it back just let it go breathe in and breathe out just all this thing you need to follow to see the progress gonna make because body transformation is not a thing that's gonna happen in one day it's gonna took you a little time a while and then you just gotta like to keep pushing you know it is simple and they also one other thing i could do some arms work hard the reason i like that tricep workout like when you're doing like chest workout always add some tricep or bicep workout the reason it is because it's gonna help your bicep and and your tricep really important i do like two or three set most of the time so you don't like to force yourself that much if you can't do all of those things but sometimes your muscle will not target different type of muscle it's really necessary so your body gonna be recovered faster and then the next day you can do the lower body you know it's important to do all of those things and then you're not gonna be great but this is the last part this is why i usually feel enjoy i usually stick to my cardio sometimes i work sometimes i won't it depends how i feel so today i was a little bit different so i'll just go okay let me just bring this thing up so i was the one like with the high intensity as i could you know just to keep the workout feel like normal you know it was great and i feel like i was leaving the day and i enjoy i got a great live and then i was just trying to get things done and so guys this is all about my workout this is everything that i do most of the time on my weight loss journey so to keep that in track so if you're on the channel don't forget to drop me a like and don't forget to follow because i'm gonna drop you a couple of tips how to actually like get everything done like your workout lane and also your meal what you need to eat all of this thing so always stick to your workout and have a wonderful day so see you around in the next video don't forget to smash that subscribe button stay safe stay focused